Types of Research Articles For Beginner's Guide to Conduct Research Number one type of research article is Original Article It is the most common type of manuscript for any journal. It is used to publish full information of any research data. The original article is commonly known as a research article or empirical research. It should not exceed more than 8,000 words. It is usually a presentation of experimental data in a research study from different research areas. Original research article format contains introduction, review of literature, methodologies, and results or conclusions. Abstract. It should include brief summary of research problem, research findings and objectives of the paper. It should be written within 250 words. 5 to 10 key words are most commonly used in abstract for any original research paper. Introduction. It is usually written in 1 to 2 pages with a maximum of 1500 words. It gives an outline of the research study in the paper. It explains about the importance of writing a research paper. Literature review. It explains about the research gaps from past publications of relevant study. It also helps us in finding a research problem. Methodologies. It usually explains how the research data is collected in a paper. The experimental data can be derived either through quantitatively or qualitatively. Quantitative data is usually collected by performing experiments or through survey. The results are usually numeric in this type of data. On the other hand, qualitative data can be analyzed by organizing group discussions or interviews. It is mainly used to produce a hypothesis. Results and discussion. Results are usually derived by analyzing the research data. Nowadays, data can be analyzed through softwares. The commonly used softwares are MATLAB, Simapro, IBM, SPSS, and NVivo. Discussions are written by interpreting the result data. Results and discussions are usually formatted in the form of tables, figures, and graphs. Number two type of research article is review article. Review articles are also considered an important part of research articles. It usually provides a comprehensive summary of research studies on a particular topic. These articles are usually longer and can range from 9,000 to 11,000 words. Review articles are the most widely read manuscripts by researchers. Generally, Articles in this type of paper cite more than 100 original research articles. There are mainly three types of review articles. Number one type of review article is systematic review. Researchers write systematic reviews to identify the methods that help in eliminating bias in research findings. Number two type of review article is literature review. Here, Review articles involves in-depth analysis and critical evaluation of a particular topic in any subject. And number three type of review article is meta-analysis. This type of review article involves assessing the results of previous research to derive conclusions. Number three type of research article is short communication or notes. It is a type of review article which is written in less than 3,000 words. It usually explains the original research data in a brief manner. Short notes usually address a few research questions from the original research articles. It should comprise of methodologies, conclusions, and suggest a few research priorities. Usually, all short communications are peer-reviewed before getting accepted for publication. The ideal short notes should include the following. Title and abstract. Introduction. Main body and conclusions. Number four type of research article is book chapter. Chapters are usually a section or divisions of a book with individual chapter titles and numbers. 
Each chapter explains a particular theme given by a book editor. The length of book chapters depends upon the given topic. Generally, publishing houses, research institutes, and universities invite authors for writing a book chapter. The leading book publishers across the world are Elsevier, Springer Nature, Wiley, Oxford University Press, etc. An ideal book chapter should meet the following requirements. It should have short, interesting and informative title. It should be approximately 3,000 to 4,000 in words. It should be able to explain over specific issue in a single article. Number 5 type of research article is conference materials. These are generally peer-reviewed, permanent, and can sit within the journal. It usually accepts the manuscripts that are presented at various workshops, seminars, international conferences. Generally, the conference materials can be presented in the following way. Conference abstracts. It is usually a part for full research paper which is presented at the conference. The abstract should be written between 300 to 500 words. The conference proceedings are later published as an article or in a book. Poster extracts. Here the researchers can present their scientific research data in the form of posters. This type of pictorial presentation looks very informative. And presentation extracts. Here. The researchers can present their research data in the form of PowerPoint presentations. Usually, the number of slides vary from 10 to 15. Number 6 type of research article is Book Review. Book Review provides the key findings of a research study at a glance. It is usually a brief report of the book. It is usually written in less than 1,000 words. Researchers generally write book reviews to improve their writing skills. The book review should be formatted in the following manner. Introduction. It should provide the background information such as objectives and research problem that reported in the book. It should also include name of the author and title. Author profile. It should provide information about all the authors like academic institution he or she working, his or her research achievements, area of interest of authors. Book format. It should include content, list of tables and figures, number of book chapters. It should also provide information about the bibliography listed in the book. And content. Here summary of all the book chapters should be written paragraph-wise. It should include preface and conclusions. Kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper. Thanks for watching.